Hello peeps, welcome back to the best Caribbean channel here on YouTube today. Back on Football Live 23 with Tyrese Tinabu at Manchester City. Ladies and gentlemen, we're kicking off with the Manchester Derby. Man City against Manchester United in the Premier League. We have Anderlecht in the first knockout round of the Champions League as well, ladies and gentlemen. We are advancing on. We've just uh, came out of the January transfer window and we're on a nice run of form. We did lose 1-0 to Tottenham and 1-0 to Brentford. Back-to-back -back losses, which were not looking good. But after that, we went on a nice run of form. We also lost to Liverpool. So a few losses uh, involved, ladies and gentlemen. But we see ourselves top of the Premier League. Two points in front of Arsenal, our former team. So it's a battle between Man City, Arsenal, and Liverpool. Crystal Palace somehow still hanging on with 51 points as well. I don't know how they're still in the top four, but they are, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be a big one as we push on to win the Premier League trophy this season and also potentially win the Champions League as well. It's going to be a fun one. We're using a new gameplay mod, so let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. And let's get into it. Well, the Manchester Derby is always a fun one, especially with Tyrese Tinnabu involved, ladies and gentlemen. I'm pretty sure we played Man U only a couple of episodes ago, maybe even last episode, I'm not too sure, as we enter the second half. Of the season, ladies and gentlemen. Again, we've thought this whole season. I mean, the whole reason Tyrus Tinnabu left Arsenal and joined Manchester City was to win the Premier League trophy because he didn't think he could do it with Arsenal after failing in the past couple of seasons with them. Um, so it'd be embarrassing if Arsenal went on to win the Premier League trophy instead of Manchester City. But we're going to do all that we can do, all in our power to make sure Manchester City lift that Premier League trophy. And hey, we're still in the Champions League with Man, uh, Man City as well. So maybe. We can challenge for that as well. Manchester United coming with a nice passing right now. Looking for a chip through ball. But number eight, Bruno Fernandes was not running for it. Cancelo clears it out. I don't think he needed to clear it like that. But he did. A lot of space down on this right hand side now. The left back has pushed up for United. They currently only have three defenders. If we can head it out, which we do. Maybe get a counter attack on down the left hand side. With Phil Foden. Blue tops are raining forward. Lovely ball up to Erling Haller. Maybe get a first time pass in. Oh to Tinabu had an open goal Tinabu switching the play one more up to the left lovely ball again Tyrese Tinabu in the box they find him on there on the volley left footed shot is blocked City win it back though Erling Haaland trying to break through now bad throw by the keeper Tinabu lays off to Haaland space up on the left hand side goes to the right instead no 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 good early effort so TT down the line, first time crossing, a bit behind Haaland, but open for Phil Foden. Oh my god. How have you managed to bottle that? What a ball, Tyrese Tinabu. How have you managed not to score from there? Robin Titi of an assist. Keeper comes to punch. Up on the right side, cross goes in for him, another cleared header. Not really dealt with by the Manchester City defence. Eventually it is up to... Tyrese Tinabu again another switch of the play up to the left hand side nice layoff Bernardo Silva now Phil Foden going Tyrese Tinabu edge of the box should have come back to TT as the throw and going Cancelo Phil Foden laying off for Tyrese Tinabu no one closing him down as he goes wide to the target not even on target man venomous shot though Bruno Fernandez nice oh I thought we had possession there Marcus Rashford going for a long shot and that one, just like TT, inches wide of the post. And Haaland, oh, goes out to the left. He can get it. One minute before half time. Haaland back in the box. We we have a corner. We get a corner. I don't know if we was going to get it or not. We do. Phil Foden goes short. Ball goes into it. Tyrese Tinabu misses the header. Half time, nil nil. Good chances for both teams. Very good chances for both teams. But well, I say good chance. They've had one shot, which went wide. But we had a couple good chances in there. Need to start taking them. Oh, nice ball out to the left. Malasia pushing up. Rashford, Martial in the box. A few United bodies in the box. It falls to Marcus Rashford. They have to go back to Bruno. Long shot goes wide again. Two shots for United. None on target. We are scrambling. Martial wants to run inside. Oh, if they made the through ball there. If they made that pass there, we were in danger. Good defense. The Tyrese Tinabu is going to push it. All the way forward. Has Erling Haaland up there with him. Run the defender. Goes Tyrese Tinabu. Oh, did he hit the post? Oh, what a run. Picked up at the halfway line. Haaland was taking the defenders off him. So he used that space. Very nicely. Burst past the defender. Does he hit the post? Oh, the side netting. Good opportunity, man. Those driving runs I love seeing from Tyrese Tinabu. Where he beats a defender or two. 
and, and just shows that sheer speed. Since he's been training his strength as well, he really pushes through the defences. He goes again, Haaland again, taking the defenders off him, left-footed shot. Now that's ridiculous. He should have went the other corner there. He should have went the other corner. What a run. Open up. He could have maybe even took one, one, more, uh, one or two more touches to get closer. Outrageous. He has times, Tinabu. Sometimes he's super clinical. And then sometimes he'll, he won't even hit the target like that. Especially in a big match like this at home. Two points in front of Liverpool. Three points are crucial in every match for the second half of the season, ladies and gentlemen. If we want to pick up that Premier League trophy. Off now to play. Martial goes down. Referee is going to Martial. I think he's going to book for simulation. Is that the CPU diving? Anthony Martial. Oh, he goes down very easily. Goes down very easily. Good to see them get booked for simulation, though. Not every day you see that. TT, nice header down. He's continuing. Oh, he's run. Down line. Oh, my God. Is TT on side? What a ball. Haaland in the box. If TT can find him. Oh, my God. His crossing is not the best. Oh, both teams are pushing players up now. Pushing bodies up. Another advantage for the away team. And another one, Martial. If the turn defender doesn't happen. And we can break. And we can break. TT coming down to the left hand side. Not the best of passes into him. But he runs. Past the defender. As Erling Haaland up there with him. Left foot shot right at the keeper. On target. But again, you've got to do better. TT. Edge of the box. One more. Oh, terrible pass. What are we doing? Haaland goes off. Hasn't had a lot of chances, Erling Haaland, in a big match like this. Maybe Titi should have found him a bit more instead of shooting. We have a corner. Tyrus Tinabu is taken. Whips it in. In front of the defender. No, everyone misses. On the right side, Titi has some space. Ball goes in. Blocked. Another corner. Titi, better delivery. This time, please. This one goes shorter. Tyrus Tinabu need a good delivery this time. Oh, it gets blocked. I fear that our best chances have come, man. Those last two chances for TT should have been it. Oh, what a ball through. Omar Marmouche, one-on-one. -on -one. He chips the key. Oh, what a goal. What a goal, ladies and gentlemen. What a finish. Omar Marm. Oh, you're not throwing confetti in our stadium, man. Get the hell out of it. Lovely through ball. Lovely chip, but I am fuming, man. In a Premier League title fight of a season... We're dropping 1-0 at home to Manchester United. TT again on this right side. That's a good delivery. That was better. Ball up. Oh, TT was waiting for it. Not happy with our start. Oh, man. Erling Haaland was silent this entire game. Maybe TT should have found him more often, to be fair. TT himself should have done better in front of goal. And ultimately, it was just us missing chances. They took one. And Manchester United win 1-0. One shot on target. We had six shots, man. Failed to make them count. Joint with Liverpool now. This is going to be a close battle for the rest of the season. 14 goals and eight assists. This is going to be a tough one. Champions League. In between Premier League fixtures, we have the Champions League, which we are also fighting for. I mean, to see Tyrese Tinabu lift a Champions League trophy would be absolutely amazing. That is, of course, what Theodore Dragomir is going for. Uh, there is a Theodore Dragomir video coming out soon titled The End of Theodore Dragomir. Episode 71 potentially is the end of TD. It's the last... Uh, it's the end of his current season. Uh, and depending on if you guys want another season or not, it could be the end of Theodore Dragomir as we're bringing the goalkeeper career mode. So make sure you go check out Theodore Dragomir, the longest series on this channel that we have had so far. Uh, if it's already out at this point, I won't spoil anything. But of course, the whole point of this season for him is to win the Champions League trophy. So we would love to see, uh, you know, that as a goal for Tyrese Tinabu as well. Nice through ball. Oh, good things offside. I definitely feel the CPU are more free and fluid with this gameplay mod. I think we're definitely going to keep this one going for the next few episodes. Again, I like to change them every few episodes just to keep it fresh, keep the series fresh. Whenever you change a gameplay mod, it's like an entirely new game. So... It, uh, it really keeps it fresh, 30, uh, you know, 33, 34 episodes into the series, wherever we are now. And we're still getting 1 out of 10s, like you guys are still smashing this series. So I think that's down to the gameplay mods. Keep changing and keep making the series fresh all over again, you know, by adding new mods. Nice lay down, ball into Erling Haaland, turn on his left foot off the post. What a chance. That's what we needed against United. What a chance. Corner goes in. Tyrese Tinabu can't really win header. Phil Foden, though. Phil Foden? Phil Fo... 
Love this game, man. Love it. Belling Haaland. Is he onside? Oh, those touches, man. You really can't touch R2 at all. As soon as Titi starts sprinting, he loses control of the ball. He needs to keep tight of focus, man. Ball up on the left-hand side. Running into the box. Ball in. Open shot. Oh, my God. I think the defender deflected it. And keeper made a great save. And it's gone up on the left again. Don't let him pass inside. We let him pass inside. Takes a touch. Good defense again. Defense keeping us in this one. Erling Haaland. With Tyrese Tinnabu. 1-2. Back through. Oh, I think it's too much. Just a little too much. I think that's what TT needs to work more with, though. With Erling Haaland, the 1-2 is running in behind. Because he likes to hold up the play in the middle. We can make the runs off him. Then he can make the runs in behind. That's what we need to do. This time out, 2 for Foden. One more into Erling Haaland. That's what we need to do. We need to get the boys involved, ladies and gentlemen. Get Phil Foden. Get Erling Haaland. Get them all involved. And just let Haaland... TT doesn't need to be the goal. That's why he joined this team. He doesn't need to be the goal scorer. Erling Haaland is there for that job. Let him be the goal scorer. 1-0 City. 45 to play. One of the Remember, this is the first knockout round. So it's a two-leg affair, ladies and gentlemen. Normal group stage. Phil Foden making a run. Tyrese Tinnabu tried to get an assist. Phil Foden goes wide again, though. Get him involved. Get Haaland involved. Let them be the goal scorers. And let TT be the top assist of the team. He has, I think, 14 goals, 8 assists so far this season. So he's doing well in both uh, departments compared to how he did for Arsenal. But he doesn't have to be the primary goal scorer for this club. The fact that they have Haaland. Oh, my God, he went down. Another dive. I think it's another dive. Esposito, the young striker, he, do, he do, uh, does dive indeed. And luckily, the referee has seen it. I think that's why Tyrese Tinnabu doesn't dive, by the way, because 99.9% .9 of the time, they catch you. Tyrese Tinnabu up to Haaland. He has Phil Foden. TT making a run. In behind, he can still be a goal scorer, though. On his left foot, no side netting again. Another big chance for Tyrese Tinnabu. He will get a goal this episode. Lovely running behind this front three. So deadly. Just needs to get on target, man. TT could be at 20 goals this season already. If he converted chances like that, he could be at 20. Or oh, bad touch. By the defender. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice chest down. Chip pass to TT. Little header down. Oh, Haaland was not quite close enough. Face in the middle there. They don't use him. Now they find him. Esposito back to Diawara. They actually have a nice team out to the left-hand side. First time shot. Great save. I thought that hit off the attacker. Apparently not. It is a corner kick. And the left have had 60% possession at home. It would be a big win to win in their stadium, remember, because we have to go to the Etihad in the second round, of course. And we know from prior seasons and also Theodore Dragomir how crucial the first leg in Europe is. Back picking it up. Out to the left-hand side. First time pass through Tyrese Tinabu. What a ball. Tyrese touch. Oh, my God. He gets it on target. But right at the keeper. You have to put that away if you're Tyrese Tinnabu. You just have to. Watch the run through. This goes back to TT if they score. Which they do. That goes back to Tyrese Tinnabu not scoring it. Because if Tyrese Tinnabu scores, I'm going to go. It's 2 0. And we're loving life. And instead, Anderlecht get the equalizer. And make the first leg 1 1. Lovely through pool. Lovely finish. Esposito actually has a game face as well. Oh my god, what a day for TT. He's not been good in front of goal at all. Erling Haaland, lovely flick down. Tyrese Tinnabu, now is your time. Keeper comes out, he's so bad at chips. Erling Haaland, open goal though. Luckily, Haaland is clinical because Tyrese Tinnabu has been awful today in front of goal. He's been absolutely awful. He tried to chip it. He never gets enough power on it. But again, luckily, Erling Haaland was there to smash it in. Open goal. Man City take the lead again, 2-1. I'm surprised. That Tyrese Tinnabu has not been subbed off. Six minutes added. Make sure we hold on, ladies and gentlemen. We're seeing some goals today, at least in this episode. Always welcome in football life. When goals are going in, Tyrese Tinnabu. What a run. Keeper off his line. Oh, no, TT. You could have chipped at that time. You could have passed it. Oh, my God. How has Tyrese Tinnabu not got a goal yet in this episode? I don't know. Oh, what a day at Turf Moor. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Live on Sky Sports. Back in the Premier League, Burnley take on Manchester City. And if Tyrese Tinnabu doesn't score today, it's a bad day, ladies and gentlemen. He needs to get a goal in this match and get three points. Ball up to Titi. First touch. Not great. Not great. Silver. Oh my God, he's offside. What a pass that would have been. <laughs> Look at the space up here for Tyrese Tinnabu. 
If we win this header, which we do, Tyrus Tinnebu is going to cut inside. In behind, lovely trip through ball. Tyrus Tinnebu fighting for it. Not going to win it though. Let's pull up, TT. One more for Erling Haaland. Is it time for his assist? He cuts into his left foot. Of course, the keeper makes a save. Phil Foden picks up though. Tyrese Tinnebu on his right foot, trying to get it in. No, it's blocked out. Was that a pass or a shot? Who knows? Tyrese Tinnebu laying it off, but not a silver. Oh, what a finish from Bernardo Silva. And like I said, Tyrese Tinnebu, he may not be scoring today, but that's all right. He's getting assists. And look at this like evening sky in, in, in Burnley at Turf Moor. Looks absolutely incredible. And what a finish. What a finish, Bernardo. Nice little thumbnail shot there. I like this Manchester City kit. Haaland looking for a handshake. He gets one. And that is a team effort, ladies and gentlemen. It comes back out. Tyrese Tinnebu was lurking. He got it. He waited. He waited. He waited. Laid it off. First time shot. My goodness. I do enjoy football life, man. I remember the first few episodes. It felt like 10 or 15, 20 episodes. Tyrese Tinnebu could not score or assist or do anything to save his life. He was really, really bad. At the beginning of his career, ladies and gentlemen, he just couldn't quite get his feet under him. Oh, he's on side. Haaland in the box. Oh, terrible cross. No. But now he's a changed man. He still struggles in front of goal sometimes, obviously, with the manual shooting. But overall, he's so much a better player than he once was. It's, it's, it's been so fun to see his journey. You know, it really has. There he is, TT. Players to the right and left. Uses Kamavinga. First time cross. Over to the right side, Bernardo Silva now. Into Tyrese Tinabu. Touch. Fake shot. Lays it back. Oh my god, that guy stopped running. Haaland picks up that guy. Number four. He was like running onto the ball then. Just stopped. Oh, watch him through the wall. Offside. Surely. Oh my god, he's onside. What a ball. He lays it one more. Edison in no man's land. Oh, he's gone wide. Don't know what Edison was doing. What a pass though. Oh my god, yeah. This gameplay mod. Tipper topper. After one nil, we take it, ladies and gentlemen. We take it. The Knights got the Burnley to Turf Moor. I wouldn't mind coming back to Turf Moor in future. Looks absolutely fantastic. Link Haaland back to Tyrese Tinnebu. Was looking out to the right hand side there. Gets tackled though. Oh, yeah, don't let him pass one more. Good block. Edge of the box though. Good tackle. Long ball up. Erling Haaland. Keeper does not come out. Oh, pff, he is unstoppable, man. He is the main man. I mean, we know, we know anyway, but. He is the main man. Oh, I wish that was TT. Look at this from the, the trip through balls in this gameplay mod are insane. Look how driven it was. Two bounces and on the half volley. I've never, I, honestly, I, like I know I say this a lot because I, I enjoy every new gameplay mod we get. Some I don't like, but this one I actually do. Like, I'll be honest, if I don't like it, I tell you guys I don't like it and we never use it again. There's been a couple that I don't like. This one is incredible. The trip through balls I'm seeing, the passing and moving in general. Oh my God. It's fantastic. E.T. good tackle. Picking the ball up in his own half. Looking to drive it forward as well. Nice close control. That's what he needs to do more. The tight dribbling. Reverse pass. Erling Haaland. Oh, bad pass in the end. Haaland picks it back up though. No. Get that coming finger. Yeah. I want to keep the clean sheet even though it's 2-0. Nice save, Edison. Nice save, Edison. Another nice through ball. See, even though like, it's Burnley, they're still playing well. At home, nice layoff. Oh, Edison. Great save. I'd be mad if Pep subbed off TT. He doesn't get subbed off a lot. We're 2 up away from home. If you want to rest Tyrese for a bigger game, wouldn't be too mad. But he also, I mean, he likes playing the full 90 minutes. Whoops, Nathan Teller in some space. Back into the striker, bodied by the defense. Erling Hallow, space up on the left. Bernardo Silva's running up, as is Tyrese Tinabu from the left-hand side. Oh, so much space because the keeper came out. But last second, he gets tackled. Been back and forth this match. Literally going back and forth from one half to the other. Harling oh, Haaland. Tyrese Tinabu gets another assist in the dying embers of the game. And Erling Haaland is literally a man on four. Oh, celebrate with TT. Yes. Well, I don't know why he's... He should be the other way around, I assume. But hey... We absolutely take it. 3-0 away win in the Premier League. We can win in the Premier League. We can get assists. No goals for TT today. But uh, sometimes that happens. You know, some days it's just not your day in front of goal. Instead, you get assists. As long as you're getting three points, we can be happy. 14 goals, 10 assists. He's got double digits 
in both of them, ladies and gentlemen. 92 speed, 90 acceleration, 85 kicking power, 92 stamina, 89 low pass, 81 finishing. What a player Tyrese Tinubu is. Well, Tyrese Tinubu doesn't play the next two games. A 0-0 draw against Newcastle and a 4-2 away win against Everton. Ladies and gentlemen, next episode, we have the second leg of the Champions League. We have Arsenal, our former team, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, and we also have Crystal Palace, who are currently in third before starting the quarterfinals of the Champions League. League. Ladies and gentlemen, it's been a fun one. Some assists in there for Tyrese Tinabu. We are th two points off Liverpool. Again, Crystal Palace are third. We're getting a bit of a gap from them, so we'll win next episode. It's absolutely crucial. Hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, please do leave a thumbs up with the video. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Much of as always, take care and peace. Oh,